Hi guys, welcome to Didy Dye's Crafty Corner. Tonight I thought we would do an unboxing. This unboxing is of the Spellbinders Kit and Caboodle Club. So if you're not familiar, Spellbinders offers a couple of different tiers in their card kit clubs each month. This is for the month of October and the Kit and Caboodle has all of the kits in one. So they have a large die of the month club die set, a small die of the club set, a card kit, and this contains all of that. So I thought we would go ahead and open it up and take a look at it, and um, then we will play with it on another day. So it comes in a box just like this. It tells you what month it is on the box. Super cute, right? And then all of your ingredients are on the inside. So I'm just gonna pull everything out and get rid of the box so we have a little more room on the desk. All right, and then we're just gonna kinda take a look at it. I'm gonna try to refer to the website if I can to tell you what it is, but it looks like it kinda tells you. So the first thing that I see is the small die of the month club. Now this is a kit that I have gotten for quite some time. I just upgraded to the kit and caboodle. So I do enjoy getting the small die of the month club because it's a very low price point and you get a little something to play with every single month. I like that. And I don't ever look at it in advance because I like to be surprised. You know, it's just a little surprise that comes in my mailbox. So this month, we are getting one, two, three, four, five dies for the small die of the month club. And it's Happy Thanksgiving, Hello Fall, and Give Thanks. This is an acorn, this is a wishbone, and then Happy Thanksgiving right there. And that is your dies right there. Let's take a look at them real quick. I'm not gonna cut them out in this video, guys, but I will do a I will, as we play with each, oh, then it's in another bag, <laughs> a bag and a bag. Um, as I work with them, I will cut them all out for you at the time that I pull them out to work with it. Okay, so let's take that out. I'm going to grab a blank card over here so I can kind of show you. So there's the happy, that's a pretty good size. This is an A2 size card. There's the Thanksgiving. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. There is the acorn. And the innard. So you could do it with or without the words. That's always nice, right? And then here's the wishbone. So those are great sizes for an A2 size card. So that one is the small die of the month club. All of these are included in this one kit. So I'm just going to kind of set that aside. I'll put it away in a minute. What I do with that small bag it was in? Hmm. Okay. You. It looks like you get envelopes and and um, envelopes. Mine are kind of squished up. Envelopes and card fronts. These are very thin card fronts compared to what I use. Has a texture on the outside, smooth on the inside. So you do get the card fronts, or that you get the A2 size envelopes and the. Um, cards themselves let's see how many do you get i wonder it doesn't come with a breakdown in the box telling you what you get four five six seven eight nine ten oh that's a pretty good number so i guess i'll have to aim for making 10 cards with this kit huh okay and then the large die of the month this month was a truck scene and um, you got like the back end of a truck here it's like a truck <clears throat> and with that you got pieces to put on the truck it looks like you got a canoe um, for you hooray and thanks you got some sprigs a star a topper uh, a tree a trunk some more sprigs i'm not sure what that is a pumpkin and this is the present that you put together and the bow. So I know what those are. I'm not sure what all these little ones are. We'll have to find out. And I've seen this put together on somebody else's card and it was super cute. And that's what it's gonna look like. 
Or did I show you on the oh, I did show you on the back of this, yeah. What they look like, right? I don't think I did. So that's what it looks like. Super cute, right? That's what the acorn looks like. And this is what the truck looks like when it's put together. And it's also adorable. So that's what the... Oh, so all those little pieces make the extra details of this truck. The tail lights, the mirrors. The truck opens up so you can put the presents in it. See that? It's got a little slit in the top of the trunk. Of the truck. That is really stinking cute. And then there's the presents and the little bow. Adorable. The fender. You can put the hooray right on their truck if you wanted to. But I think you could. You don't have to put it on there, I don't think. Oh, that's cute. Okay. And this is a ton of little dies in here, guys. So many dies. This is exactly why I have not done this. Because it seems like it's so much. But it's. I think it's going to be fun, right? Let's just see what size this truck is. Oh, so a few of those dies are the tires. So that's an A right there. That's what that's going to look like. A little piece that fits in there. Too many. Way, way too many. Way too many. I can tell you already these are going to get lost. Come here, you little booger. So the tail lights. Little flower centers, it looks like. I don't know what we use those for. Definitely looks like a little flower, though. The presents, the little pumpkin. Definitely gets you all kinds. Here's the tree. I think this is supposed to be like a Christmas tree, maybe. So there's the tree. I know that there's a trunk in there. I read that. There's a canoe. The presents. The canoe. More little sprigs. To me, this looks like a beach ball, right? Hooray for you. So inside your truck, you could put for you. You could put thanks or you could put hooray. That's really cool. And then straight sprigs. Star. The mirrors. And the tree topper. So you can make a little Christmas tree. That is adorable. And I'm not, this looks like uh, just leaves, maybe. I'm not sure what this is either. I don't know, but I think it probably goes with this tree, would be my guess. All right, so we're going to have to look this this up before we can play with it. But that is a ton of stuff to play with, right, guys? Wow. I'm going to put these back in here so I don't lose them. So I think we may do that one first. See, I already dropped one. Good goobers. All right, so that is the large die of the month book. And then we get the card kit. And this is what the card kit was. This is what it had. So part of that kit was this house. We got the dies to make a house. I think it has a little fence. It had some feathers, stuff like that. So let's look at these. All right, so there's our little house, our little roof. Another word, this one says celebrate. This little die right here, this little bracket, actually makes a frame. So if you cut this out four times, um, oh, I think it's back here. Is it this it? Yeah. See, if you cut it out four times, it makes a little frame. So you get the feathers, you get some leaves, and then you would use your die cuts that come with it, and you would make this little frame. Super, super cute, right? So that's what this is. It makes the frame. We have one feather, two feathers. We've got the gate. 
We've got numerous windows, numerous leaves. Look at that. Oh, that's a little um, wreath to go on the door. There's our door. Oh, well, this is the wreath to go with the with this. There's the wreath for the door right there. Super, super cute. Look at all the little windows. And then we have this little piece right here, which I'm not really sure where it goes. We'll have to look and see. Oh, I bet you it's a piece to go right there. Look at that. Super, super cute, right? Oh, I can't wait to play with these guys. This is going to be so much fun. So that one's going to go back in here. I'm not sure what I did with the paper for that. I just threw it aside. Now I can't even find it. So that's super cute. So many little dies, right? So many little dies. <clears throat> I may have to adjust the volume of this when I play when I go to play it back because I caught a cold. All right, so there's what that is. So this is the card kit. And as you can see, it's showing you that you can use some of the little die cuts that are in here and then these dies to make that little house, which is super cute. We got a pad of paper and this was all about watercolor. So it was all watercolor inspired. And so here's the paper. You get two sheets of each one. Super, super pretty paper. It is paper though. It's not cardstock. So it is paper. That's really pretty. Um, looks like it all has a gold, <coughs> gold, gold, copper, maybe. I'm not sure of the color because of my lighting in here. It's hard to tell. That's pretty. Let's see. I think it's just gold. Could be rose gold. Maybe copper. That's very pretty. It's one. I'm going to go with rose gold, maybe. That's really pretty, right? Those butterflies are super adorable. Oh, that's beautiful. And that's beautiful. I love that. I aspire to be able to do this in real life with watercolor. Mine never looks quite that good, but that's super pretty. I love those colors, too. I love that. It has little words in it. That's so pretty. Oh, that's so pretty. This looks like it might be a blue with that gold color in it, light blue. Very pretty. And then we're starting over. Green with the little splashes. I really like that. Oh, did we see that one? Are we starting over? No, that's gorgeous. Oh, pretty. That's so pretty, right? Ooh, pretty, pretty. Now we're starting over. So you do get two sheets of each one. I like that, because that way I don't feel like I'm having to hoard it. It is single-sided, though. And that is by Spellbinders. It's the paper by Spellbinders. It's called Watercolor. So we got that in there. And then we got um, Watercolor Variety Sticker Set. So... Okay, so these are popped up. They have a little dimension on them. It looks like we get four of those, a feather, a dream catcher, thanks a bunch, and you're my happy. So we get a couple of sentiment pop-ups as well as that feather. Definitely rose gold, definitely rose gold. And then we get some just um, words or sentences, you know, that are on some watercolor paper here. And that's all gold, rose gold as well. So together, forever, loved, eternally grateful, so special, love you, fun, family life, just the right mix of chaos and love. Oh, I love that. Our story, moments that matter, love beyond words. These are stinking cute, guys. Those are so cute. Family is everything. It's the little thing. So you could use this for cards, journaling, um, your... Um, photo books, photo journals. Oh, you could use these for anything, right? 
And then this looks like these are the clear stickers with the watercolor and they're just gorgeous. They are absolutely stunning. Look at that. Love you to the moon and back. Laugh, love, dream together, enjoy the day. And so they're clear, but with watercolor um, colors to them, which would just make them pop on anything white or if really anything. Gorgeous, love those. Love those. Oh, that is so cool. <coughs> we did get a stamp set, and this is a watercolor stamp set. It looks like it has a terrarium. Let's look. All right. Am I the only one that smells stamp sets? Ugh, crazy. I think I'm crazy. You help me grow. So you have a terrarium. You have a couple of... Um, well, all of these are solid, so that would be great to use your distress sinks and watercolor, you know, spray it down, use some watercolor would be beautiful. Plus, you get some centers, you get some sprigs and some leaves and, and a sentiment. Super, super cute. That's fun. And these look like journaling cards and tags. Look at those. Oh, I think a little sequin escaped. Oh, that's a little die. Poop. Look. <laughs> Where do you suppose he came from? Oh, good gravy. I'd say it's that truck right there. Okay, let's put him back in there. Okay. It's got to be one of the lights for the truck. Go back in there, buddy. Don't get lost so I can play with you. Good gravy. Okay. All right, so these are little journaling cards or Project Life type cards, right? So it looks like you get some of those. So memo, memories create, create memories. <laughs> Look at that, memos. I was trying to read that as two words. Mem create memories. And then on the back, it's got little pluses. So those are double-sided. That's cute. Oh, look at that. Happy moments. You are loved. Happy days. House plus love equals home. Adored. This is my flock. I love this one love it oh how cute is that it's beautiful i like the back too amazing oh look at that love it that would be hard for me that would be super hard for me to figure out which one of those to use okay then we have hello so we have some tags we have a flamingo that's very cute celebrate with all my heart and a flower so those are super super cute what are these? Epoxy stickers. So these look like wooden buttons with pop dots on the back with epoxy little sayings on them. <clears throat> All right, let's look at these. Watercolor epoxy stickers. Those are really cute. They do look like little wooden buttons though. Okay, curious minds want to know. Guys, I know you're screaming. Don't scream too loud. Shush. It'll be okay. Shush. Uh, who wants to come off? Do you want to come off? You do. Thank you. Oh, they are little wooden buttons. Look at that. Cuteness. So if you didn't want to use a little epoxy, you could use them as buttons. Let's put you back. Thank you for playing along. I know you guys are freaking out. Okay, those are super cute. So you've got Love My Life. Oh, today, hi. Hug, is that a hug? Love, I don't know. Hug me, mm, a coffee cup. Little flowers, a little pattern, my darling. Just be you, a heart, and and. Those are super stinking cute. So you couldn't see they were buttons from the back. Oh yeah, you can, you can see the little holes there. So they're all little buttons. Oh, how adorable. That is cuteness. 
adorbs. Okay, so epoxy stickers. Those are cute. And then die cut shapes. Okay, we'll do that last because we're gonna have to dump those out so you can see them. We got some sequins in that same, well, this doesn't look rose gold though. This looks more, well, okay, some metallic color. Could be dark gold or maybe bronze maybe. Doesn't really look rose gold, but maybe it is. My lighting, you know, I don't know. So we got some sequins. We got some double-sided tape, it looks like. That's nice when they include the tape. <coughs> Let's check that out. Oh, it's nice and sticky. So I'd say that is, what, about a quarter inch? It's more than an eighth. It's right about an eighth, I guess. Yeah, it's a little more than an eighth. It's not It's not quite a quarter. That's nice. Sticky. Doesn't say whether it's removable or not, so we're going to go with it's probably not. It's probably permanent. And we got some silver thread, metallic silver thread. Super pretty. And we got some um, pop-ups and pop dots. The nice thing about having these is not only can you use what you see here, but you can cut out what's in between here and make smaller little versions as well. So we've got those. And then we've got our cardstock. We'll look at that real quick and then we'll pour these out. So the cardstock feels a lot like their feels to be the same weight as their card bases. It has a texture on the front of it, a waffle texture on the front, and not as much of a texture on the back. So we've got this nice sunflower yellow, blue, pink, green. All of these have the same texture. A nice teal, this white. Let's see, where does card bases go? Yeah. So it is, it's the same as what these cards are made of. That's their white, that's the Spellbinders white. A little bit flatter on the back. Has a different texture than most card stocks, right? To me, it kind of feels like wallpaper. Hmm, nice texture, I like that. And a black, and then this nice metallic gold, rose gold maybe. This is nice. That's super nice. All right, so there's the card stocks that came in the kit. And then we got these die cut shapes. And let's look at these. <coughs> I had to steal these away from Christina the other day. She grabbed them. She thought they were pretty. Oops. Oops. I got a chair in it. Those are pretty. All right, set that aside. We'll just flamingo, a ticket, love beyond words. Those are pretty. So it looks like you get two of each. Those are super pretty. Is the best place. You are the. Got some balloons. Together, family, always. Free hug. Oh, <laughs> that's so cute, a ticket for a free hug. Oh, look, a little flower box. That's so cute, right? Adorable. Keep this coupon, mason jar. I love your hugs. Life is better with you. Celebrate each day. I love the little rulers. How cute is that? Adorbs. A feather. Family matters most, some houses. We got a variety of houses. That is adorable. Together. So it has a little section here to pop it out as well to finish it up. Oh. Pretty, huh? That's pretty. So we get two of those. 
ton of little houses, guys. I happen to be quite fond of houses and watercolor, so this is really looking very celebrate. Some blue feathers, aren't those pretty? <clears throat> Butterflies, look at these. That's very pretty. Memories, or mem memorize. <laughs> oh, that was funny. You keep me real. Cherish this moment. A couple of blue flowers. Digging these flowers are so pretty. This is a very cute little butterfly too. Very pretty. Um, another um, bookmark. It looks like this heart pops out though, so you could pop that on and pop the heart up. That would be super cute. <clears throat> Best little dream catcher. <clears throat> All of us, family time, I love you. Got some little yellow flowers. Oh, look at that butterfly, guys. Super, super cute. These are super pretty. This is a pretty set. There's no doubt about it. Today is your day, day, free hug again. Love beyond words. I love you. Those are pretty. Those are super, super, super pretty. Oh, and look how well all that goes together as well. All right, guys, so that is everything in this kit. I believe the kit in the Caboodle kit and Caboodle is, pro, is right around, I think, $59. But you can buy each one of these things. Like you can buy the card kit for a lower price, just getting the card kit, or just getting the small die of the month club, or the large die, or the large and small. They have all different um, combinations of what you can get. I've always done the small die of the month club just as a little surprise to myself. Is you know just something that comes in and I've always loved it so I thought I would give this a try and see how many cards I can create with it so we will be working on that this month that this next month coming up um, let me know in the comments below what you found to be most attractive about this card kit what did you like the most in this kit and um, I will see you guys in the next video bye